Can you share the story behind naming your company Goldor? Is there any special meaning or inspiration behind it? Yeah, well, I started my career with, with Anglo-American in the gold sector way back in the year of 1989, February of 1989. I think. And I did a two-year graduate um, program with them. And I think it was I think it was a program just to cut us down to size because you come out of university, think you know everything and you get to work shifts in this program and carry buckets of slurry around and, uh, you know, in overall. So you're really learning from the ground up, which is which is a wonderful program. I don't know if they still exist today, but I certainly learned a lot. Um, and so I cut my teeth, um, I would say, on metallurgy um, in the gold sector. That's where I actually learned the ropes and, and learned all the rules of the game but also that's where i discovered what all the where all the inefficiencies are because you know as fresh eyes when you look at something and 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 there's something being thrown out onto a tailings dam and you ask why there's still a lot of gold in those tailings why are we throwing it away why aren't we extracting it you know sort of obvious questions from a person looking from the outside in uh, but to the people working there it's like that's what they've been doing for years they didn't even question it uh, but obviously i saw uh, the room for improvement i saw the areas where you know something needed to be done and so when i designed the mach initially it was put together with the intention of solving those problems that i had seen already witnessed for myself in the gold industry and we've done that very successfully pre-oxidation boosted leaching we can improve gold recoveries and you know we've proven that over and over again globally um, but then of course it's we're not just in gold we're also in base metals platinum uh, you know, pga metals the um the industrial mineral sector for example uh, base metals battery mineral, minerals so there's quite a lot of um, of um, diversification away from gold where we originally started and there's even water treatment environment uh, environmental remediation uh, but at the end of the day, when, when it came to coming up with a name, I had to think of um, what name sort of resonates with me. And I immediately thought of gold because that, that was sort of my first love in metallurgy. That's what I was familiar, I became familiar with first. Um, and apart from that, gold has always had this sort of emotive allure to it. You know, we're always striving for gold in the Olympics or you have the gold standard, which is the Mach, by the way, <laughs> in its field. Um, and, and so, you know, that yellow metal has always had this mysterious attraction. And I thought to bring some of the emotion and passion that we have in Gold Ore as a company, um, I thought the word gold reflected that. Um, and that is why we, you know, we've, we came up with the name uh, Gold Ore, which we then went and, and, and tested because you needed to check and see whether anybody else in the world had that name as a company. And we were really, really surprised to find that nobody, after all of these years, since the 1800s of, of dealing, extracting gold, nobody had a name, Gold Ore, for a company. So we snapped it up uh, immediately and uh, we're quite happy you know, with our choice. Although I would have to say, um, if we had given the company any other name, I don't know whether it would have made that much of a difference. And the Mach is such an accomplished piece of technology. And as the saying goes, a rose by any other name would smell just as sweet.